Scale 174 presents Late Night with Kevin O'Shea. Now here he is, Kevin right. O'Shea. Thank you. Welcome to Late Night with Kevin O'Shea, everyone. We have a great show for you tonight. Everyone has been talking about the liquidation of Hostess. But not to worry, Pap Ruben may be buying Hostess and starting to make Twinkies. Yep, beer and Twinkies, or as I like to call it in college, brunch. Mitt Romney was spotted at Disneyland. You could tell it was Romney because he spent a lot of time with Snow White, but completely ignored Snow Black and Snow Latino. No bueno. What a great show we have for you tonight. We have DJ Strong Arm Ron from Mercer Radio Station, and what a great guy he is. But first, I was reading the newspaper yesterday and noticed some interesting headlines that caught my eye. Thought I'd share some with you. Woman falls in a hospital and told to call ambulance. The irony almost killed her. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. Republican turned off by the size of Obama's package. That just sounds like a personal matter to me. I won't judge any president by the size of his package. <laughs> How could you do that? You should give him props for his package. The last one I was a little concerned about. Lost brown squirrel, last seen driving a silver and blue van. I hope whoever scrolled that was was driving home safely. Well, guys, you know this next guest is DJ Strong Arm Ron from Mercer County Mercer College Radio Station. Welcome, DJ Strong Arm Ron. Welcome to the show, man. Happy to see you. That just makes me happy that you're happy. <laughs> All right. How are you? Not too bad. How about you? Good, How was your trip in? Nice. Nice? No complaints. First class all the way? Second class, but it worked. Second class? All right. <laughs> Make sure you get on first class on the way out. Will do. Well, thanks for being here. Now, here's a question. I have to know. Where did the name DJ Strong Arm Ron come from? <laughs> I, mean, I get that. Really cool I thank you, thank you. I think so. Originally from Long Island, New York, and in hip hop, all the boroughs have aliases, and Long Island is Strong Island. So, me, I've always been an A-type personality, a little, right. you know. But I, so, so for me, I, I just adapted it, all changed right. it to Strong Arm Ron, because it represents where I come from, Very and nice. I got a strong arm philosophy for my lifestyle. So good. I do, because I feel like life fights you every day. You got to be ready to push back. So you have to be spiritually, mentally, and physically a strong arm person. That so, is a go. very good explanation. Thank you. Thank you. Right on, man. <laughs> I heard you're really into hip hop. How'd you transition from hip hop to DJing? Um, I just, when I decide to make a move, I just do it. And I, I love hip hop, but there's so many rappers out there that I was getting tired of the rap scene. So I wanted to just switch my perspective. And I figured DJing was a great way to help guide the culture. Absolutely. And so I, ch I chose that path. And it's something I've been really enjoying. I still rap, but I, but no, it's, it's, mostly, uh, it's mostly, mostly this. Mostly DJing. I see a bigger picture from That's that. That's your new lifestyle? It is. It's the same lifestyle. It's just a different perspective. I like that there's a table between me and the audience and the crowd. All I right. like a little bit of a barrier between what's going on. Sometimes. Yeah, so too I, up close and personal too much is yeah. a little too much, especially if you don't know them. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Bad breath, you know, All ugly chicks, don't want any of those up in front I keep of no. gum with me just for fans, I just throw it out. <laughs> yeah, it's not a bad <laughs> idea. I wish I could do that with some of our producers. <laughs> well, word on the street is that you're hosting a new television show called Big Break. Yeah, can I you can. tell me more about it? I tell can. us more about it. I can, me. I can. I appreciate the opportunity to speak about it. So Big Break is going to be a talent showcase for artists, hip-hop and R&B, but mostly it's, it's going to be geared toward hip-hop because you don't really see a lot of talent shows on television that involve hip-hop. You see stuff like The Voice and American Idol, and it's mostly singing and it's pop, but you don't see uh, rap artists get opportunities. So some people I know from North Jersey are going to put this together. It's going to be filmed in Atlanta at Center Stage, which is a, a huge venue. And they oh, want to yeah, shoot yeah, it for yeah. a pilot. They want to try to push it to some TV shows. So. That seems like an awesome opportunity. Whenever you need a co-host, just let me know. I will definitely bring you in. You know That's what I'm saying? That's what's up, man. That's what's up. On the commercial breaks when they need somebody to laugh at the shit. All right. I'm, <laughs> I'm good at that. You know, both, you know, look wise and... No, you got the jokes. I saw you come in. It was pretty funny. I like the Snow White one. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> well, you know, before I got this gig, I wanted to be a rapper. 
Oh, I know you've done some rapping back in the day. Way back. I would love to hear some. I don't know. Some, some of your stuff. It's possible. Do you mind if I bring your name into it, do you? No, I'd, I'd love to hear my name in it. Be a first. It'd be a first? Yep. Really? First for me. In a rap, yeah. Right, no doubt, no doubt. We'll have to do that for you. Let me know when you're ready. <clears throat> okay, go. All right, so it's late night with Kevin O'Shea. Something for the evening that we cooked up in the day. They call me strong on because the kid don't play and they call him Big Kev. He's the late night kid. All right. I like that. That works for me, man. That works for me. I'm All right. About some well, that was awesome, man. Appreciate it. Thanks for being on the show. That's DJ Strong Arm Ron, everybody. <laughs> Visit him on his website at strongarmron.com. Please do. Thank you for being on the show, man. Have a great day. Come back anytime. Much success. Thank you. <laughs> well, guys, it's Tuesday. When I usually like to catch up on some of my personal stuff. I check my inbox, I send out some thank you notes. I was running a bit behind today. Is it cool if I write some weekly notes? Some weekly thank you notes? Anybody? Well, it's my show, so I'm going to do it anyway. All right. Thank you, zebras, for showing me what a horse looks like on acid. It's not cool. Thank you, Jim, for being exactly like my grandpa. Always there for me when I, when I need you, and, but I only visit you twice a year. Thank you, people who clap for the pilot when the plane lands, for basically applauding the fact that you're not all dead. Well, you know, that's something to be thankful for, you know. How ungrateful some people are. And lastly, thank you, high school reunions, or as I like to call you, Facebook Live. Well, there you go. Those are some of my thank you notes. One more thank you to DJ Strong Arm Ron for coming on down. Tune in tomorrow night, late night with Kevin O'Shea. Good night. All right. Good job, Chad. <laughs>